No, 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 no. you have to wrap, wrap your legs around it. Put this leg up. And then, and then hold on. Oh, That's it, oh, almost. Need you need to get your bum on there as well, Andy. Oh, Hello folks and welcome to today's vlog. As you can see, we are out and about. Unfortunately, it's, it seems like summer has gone away and we've come to a slightly different park to the one we usually go to that's near our house. This park is enormous. It's right near the P.O. box because we've just been to the P.O. box to pick up the final few bits of stuff from that after closing that down. If you didn't watch yesterday's vlog, go back and watch yesterday's vlog. I explained why we're closing the P.O. box, but we went and picked up the last few bits from there. And on the way home, thought we'd come here to this park that we haven't been to for years that Andy quite likes. And there's lots of really cool stuff here. It's massive. I don't understand. It's the summer holidays. I know it's a bit overcast today, but is this old man old man rant incoming is this really what modern kids have come to that it's the middle of the summer holidays there's a facility like this available but that's so that you can don't fall off it i guess i don't know you have to put your legs through i don't know how the swing works but have we really got to the point where there's stuff like this available and there's literally nobody else here at like two o'clock in the afternoon in the middle of the summer holidays that's mad. <laughs> Andy, I don't think that's how you're supposed to get in it. Get you're supposed to put your legs through. Your leg. Put your legs in put there. Put your legs through. And then your other leg. Yeah, and then you're on it like that. And then, there you go. I don't know why it's got a little lap band thing on it. That seems weird. Oh, hey, good stuff. <laughs> there you go. It works now. But we're going to the church. We're not going to the church. We're going to have a look at the quote. Well done, Daddy. The other thing it's right near is the church that he used to go bell ringing at so we've had to drive past that to come here and that's obviously reminded him of that so he now wants to go there which we're not going to do. We're not welcome there. We can watch the bells at 6 o'clock. We're not watching bells today. Watching bells tomorrow off the beach, yeah? No. I want to go on the zip line. I used to love the zip line. Why don't you go on a swing? There's loads spare. My um, wow. I believe that it will. I think you need to prove that it won't. No. Oh, careful. Now you've got to find out a way to get out of it. Weird, weird swing. Is that how they're supposed to work or did we figure them out wrong? No, 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 you have to wrap, wrap your legs around it. Put this leg up. And then, and then hold on. Oh. That's it, oh, almost. <laughs> you, need oh, you need to get your bum on there as well, Andy. I can't get him up. Hold on. You have, to, you have to sort of sit on that bit. That someone's you, hold that. wrecked it. Hold yeah. On. That's the chain, I think. Right, you have to kind of sit on it, Andy. It's, am I going to have to demonstrate how to use it and right. break it in the process? <laughs> hold that, hold that. Right, let's get you on there. <laughs> Try and explain how to do this. There you go, yeah. like that. Are you on? Now hold on tight. Really you have to hold tight. on because you're not strapped yeah. on. Holding? So yeah. you have to stay ready, holding on. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well Finish? Is it good? And then you can just drop off. No, he can get off himself. He's all right. Put your legs back up. <laughs> what are you trying to do to him? Back up there. Oh, I see. That's not a good angle. There you go. I don't think I've ever seen him go on one of those before. Slowly. You need a hand? No, he's all right. He's 15 now. He can do. Oh, that's a wobbly one. Yeah, that's what I mean. He's all right. I'm going to make you sit in the car. Let him have some independent fun. Wibbly wobbly. <laughs> it is wibbly wobbly. <laughs> You are going to get a time out in a minute. Let him hurt himself. That's what teenage boys do. Oh, 
going to Bourne for the outdoor swimming. We're not going there today. The other thing he really wants to do is go to the outdoor swimming pool, which is, it's like 20 miles from where we are now. It's not warm enough for an outdoor swimming pool today. Yeah, oh, there you go, you got in there easy peasy that time. We're going to outdoor swimming after. We're not going outdoor swimming today, Out on a warm day. No, let's just We have to wait for it to be sunny again. Have you, for the third time, put anything in the gym? No, shall I do that now? <laughs> They're for rugby, not for NFL or American football. They're rugby posts, you monster. No. Oh, to the game. They're for rugby. <laughs> Goodness me. You are not teaching him right. Can you talk to mummy? Hello, Hello. <laughs> yeah. He used to find those bits much more amusing when he was younger. I think you might be a bit big for this climbing frame now, Andy. I think you have to stay on the bigger things. Oh my word, what are you doing? I've never seen him do so much stuff at the park. This is, uh, this is very cool. We're going to the church. Yeah. We're not going to the church here. We can go to a different church. We're not going to this one. We're not going to Crowland Abbey. Apologies as well, of course, for the really windy background noise. I'm on the big camera with the external mic, with the wind sock and everything on it. But I imagine it still sounds pretty awful, but you know, none of us wanted to just stay at home. We had to get him out and about, and it's a windy day. Got to pick your battles, haven't you? So this is kind of our normal summer holiday routine. We can't let him have more than a couple of days in a row at home doing nothing because although he'll happily do that, at the moment, because we're timing it right, he's happy to come out and have fun and he's leading all of this and having a good time. If we'd have let him stay at home for a couple more days, then he starts to get into the routine of never going out at all. And then it becomes harder to get him out for stuff that we know he really wants to do. Like we've got trips to Nottingham and Skegness and Belgium and stuff like that that we're planning on doing. So in order to keep him used to being out and about for stuff like that, we have to take him out on little smaller, half hour, hour long trips out like this. Quite apart from anything else, it's good for him to get out for a little bit anyway. Burn off a little bit of energy, helps him sleep better, a bit of fresh air, a bit of vitamin D, even though it's cold and cloudy today. As you can see, he's having a good time. Uh, excuse me if there's high fives being given. Thank you. <laughs> oh, did I leave you hanging? <laughs> Again. Hooray. 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 Stay on, stay on, stay on. We can take you at this end. And turn you back again. Oh, you're having enough. Oh, he's half on. Oh, oh. <laughs> he said he was getting off, so I let him go. What? <laughs> I was dragging him up the other end to release him again, and he said finished. So I thought, oh, he wants to get off, let go, <laughs> turned around, and he's hanging on to it for dear life. Oops. Sit down. We're having our picture taken. <laughs> yeah. You have to check Anna's Instagram for that picture, I imagine. Are you going to climb up this one? Yep. Oh, well. Tell mummy to yeah. let go and let you do it yourself. No, he wants to get down. No, he's trying to get up higher. 
Oh god. Oh. Be careful. <laughs> the time will be. Oh man, I, I'm not going to be able to support him. He needs to <laughs> crawl, maybe. Do you want to get down now? Oh. He's trying. I am all for letting him learn by doing, but goodness me, was I bricking it there. <laughs> as he was trying to walk along that long one. He would have gone for that. That's, if we and Anna weren't here, he'd have gone for it and probably been able to do it. But clearly, Anna, we panicked a little bit too much and it panicked him. Oh, Anna's just fallen over. What are you doing on the floor? Why is your shoe off? You all right? What happened? Chasing. Oh. <laughs> you were chasing him? I was chasing him with a hole. Oh, a hole? I thought you said a mole. No, a hole. Are you okay? Yes. Oh dear. Well, at least now I can clickbait the video with Please. park injury! I swear to park injury, I've never seen any videos. <laughs> <laughs> well, I didn't get you falling over on camera. But we have got you sat on the floor now in the aftermath. I can't. Can you do it again so I can film it? <laughs> Meanwhile, over here, Anna's fine, by the way. She's putting her shoe back on. Meanwhile, while she's on the floor over there, Andy's halfway through the dog agility course, which he's just run off. I think, is it a dog agility course or a BMX track? I think it might actually be a BMX track. Are you okay now? Because people will call me a monster if I don't you ask. Are, you are a monster. Why? You, you wouldn't ask if the camera was up here. But I did ask. <laughs> Why? Well, hey, look at you. You doing another lap? Well, um, Burn off some energy. Chasing mummy. Mummy's chasing you again, is she? no idea how she managed to fall over but I need to at least keep her in the background so if she goes over again I've got it on camera this time not in the puddle not in the puddle <laughs> if you can see what he's doing but he went up both parts of the track there just to make sure he went on every bit of track did you fall over again or are you supposed to be there Andy bus it is a bus it was a male bus was it yeah well I think the only thing he hasn't done at this enormous park is play basketball but we don't have a ball, so we can't. Or else we'd do some one-on-one uh, -on -one basketballing. Me and Anna haven't fallen out, that's not why we're sitting so far away from each other. There's a, there's a hole in the middle of the bench that's full of water. He's just going around and around again on this, what we think is a BMX track. He's having a whale of a time. I'm hoping you can hear me in this wind, but he's loving it. I've never seen him voluntarily get this much exercise. How long would you say we've been out at this point? About an hour. About an hour. Yeah. Have you got your Fitbit on? How many steps have you done as part of this? 2,397. Nice. Not a lot. But no, but I guess he's done a lot more than you. Yeah. So, well, about, <laughs> yes, you did. about an hour of physical exercise, which is way in excess of what we were hoping for from this trip. Our plan was let's get him outdoors for 15, 20 minutes, get him some fresh air. But he's absolutely embracing it. No, he doesn't even have his camera with him, no DS, no technology at all. I don't know if I ever remember seeing him in the past just enjoying playing at the park without oh, being we? threatened to do Our it. Our first time out with him, that time, when yeah. uh, I grew up. Yeah, I guess. That, that was, was seven long. years ago though. Oh, yeah. No electronics, this is awesome. Good oh, boy. For him? You want me to go with you? I, you can't hold the camera. Oh my word. <laughs> hold on, do you want to hold the small camera? Yes, that's right. You hold this one, though. Film on your side. <laughs> Just one, it's filming now. We're on your side. Go on then, do one. Just as I said, he's not using any electronics. He said he wanted to film a video for Through Andy's Eyes. We don't have his camera with him. 
so I've let him borrow the little G7X. You can guarantee he wouldn't be using that if I wasn't getting my new one any day now. Remember, use it for remembering stuff, so he wants to remember this. Yeah, I know. He's going to want it on his channel, isn't I'm it? just very nervous that my <laughs> £600 camera is going it's on a BMX truck. Guarantee this is going to go in the puddle. Almost guarantee it. Careful on the puddle, is it? There we go. Literally this morning I was talking to Anna about selling my old G7X Mark II, no, the one that had the little dead, pips, dead pixel on, just because I'm never going to use it again, get a couple of hundred quid for it. Because the Mark III is on its way and I don't need two Mark IIs and a Mark III, plus this camera, plus the other camera. I've got too many cameras. But now it turns out... And more fish fingers, please. We're going to go get some fish fingers, are we? Okay, we can go to the shop and get some fish fingers. What a day! Um, but yeah, perhaps I'm not selling the other G7X after all. Perhaps he's going to claim it. Which would help with the quality of his videos, no end. We were on the way back to the car, but he's... Uh, He's gone to do one more go around that, which we're just not going to argue with. This is awesome. Major, major positive result today. The yes. Yes. Yes, we Yes. We're playing EA Sports with Patreon. Okay. okay. Well, there we go. Pack trip complete. What a roaring success that was. How's about that for a healthy trolley then? Still going strong. The day when this stuff looks and tastes like bacon, that's when I go vegan. They're quite nice. Sheepdogs had them. He reckons they're quite nice. Do you want one? <laughs> Not this week. We've got our food for this week. Uh, 30, 20 or 10? Wrong door, Wendy. 30, 30 or 20. Um, in just, in light, in the, for freezer space, 10 might be better. Very chilly. 10 of those ones. These are the ones he normally has. 10 of those. Freezer's practically full. Do you have a cod he usually has cod. Those are the ones he's been eating. We can take here now. Yeah. Oh, right, are we happy we've got everything? Yeah. Excellent. Okay. Well, that's the first trip to Tesco we've needed since getting the shopping sorted on Sunday. And it's just stocking up on fruit and salad that we've eaten, plus getting Andy some fish fingers. I've never known us be this healthy. It's marvellous. And I'm still feeling motivated about it too. I think I've had a blow to the head. And we're finishing things off again back outside where I've got to finish off recording the video I started recording earlier today and then I've got about six Football Manager videos to edit and this vlog. This is going to be a long night. If you've enjoyed today's vlog, please make sure you leave a nice big thumbs up on there for me. Subscribe to the channel for daily vlogs. I almost said Football Manager videos because I'm sat in this chair. And thank you very much for watching.